Hey guys, Nick here from Your House Fitness. Today I'm going to be talking about the traps. So, traps are a very infamous muscle because often in our society, everyone's traps are very tight. We're walking around like this. So, learning about how the traps works can really help out with our shoulder health and our posture. So, when we're working on the traps, we really want to think about releasing them and then contracting them. Getting this motion is going to help um, release the traps in this isometrically contracted position, bring our shoulders down, and that will help clear the space inside our shoulders for any kind of pressing movement, any overhead movement, pretty much any movement with our arms. We're going to need our shoulder to be able to be depressed, elevated, and that comes from movement in the traps. To get some movement in our traps, we're going to just grab some weights. They don't actually need to be that heavy. They can actually lighter may be helpful in this uh, exercise. We're going to let our shoulders come down as low as they can. And then from here, we're going to pull them back, hold for a second, and slowly release. As we're going through this motion, we're learning how it feels to let our traps release, pulling down, bring our shoulder into a more depressed position which again will help out for any kind of pressing or rowing movements. Common mistakes is when we're going for a shrug, keeping the shoulders forward like this. At this, when we're doing exercises like this, we're never actually coming into a, a more neutral posture with our shoulders and our spine. So we're not actually working on that good posture. So again, when we're doing our shrugs, make sure that we don't stay in front just like so. Another mistake, or I wouldn't say a mistake, but if you're trying to get a proper function with the traps, it's going really, really heavy on the shrugs and not getting a full range of motion. You will get some stress in the traps and they may grow from hypertrophy, but we're not working through a full range and we're not really getting that full health benefit of what we're actually trying to do, which is learn how to move the traps, move our shoulder in a healthy position.